Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. We're on episode number five of Let's Game Decadence as Cadiz. So, we started off as a, as a double Sheik of Cadiz. We had uh, Cadiz and Algaceras. Now we are moving up in the world. We've got a few vassals. I've already had one genius son. So hopefully... You know, I'd, I'd really prefer for these stupid women to spit out more babies. This one's given me nothing but women, nothing but daughters. This one's given me none. She does have that minus five fertility, but she's lustful, so she could make kids. She's just choosing not to. I mean, strong one didn't end up making any strong kids or genius kids. And it was just this random one that we got the genius from. So all of my well-made plans have failed. Yeah, now he's going to move on and assault my territory. My son's territory. Don't capture my son. Don't kill him, please. Don't do it. I'll murder you. My leash is losing his war. I'm winning my war. This is a good opportunity to attack the people that are rebelling. And I don't think we have a truce time with you anymore. So we'll do that soon. The good news about all the succession problems is that it lowered Crown Authority again, which means we'll have more time to attack Muslims. And now he's in Sevilla. Still hasn't actually taken many of my own land. This army is trying to take some of my own land. I don't like that. Even just being here lowers the income due to the protected level. Get our tech up. Let's go with uh, siege equipment. Let's beat her. Ooh, and I now I'm incapable... I'm now infirm instead of incapable. Or sorry, incapable instead of infirm. Which means we have to have a regent. Which means that we can't educate my son. So we'll use him for opinion then. We'll give him off to... Um, I guess the... Awali. As soon as we end up finishing up our sieges, eventually, we'll move into Tangier to protect our county. And if I die soon, which is pretty likely, we'll just end up having to play as my son, which is not too much different. My son will end up being... he's still underage, but we should be okay. Make a new steward. We need at least 400 men here, so let's just, let's just break off 700 and go clear out Tangier. Get out of my land. There, we just scared him away. Made him reset his siege timer. That's pretty good. Now, my diplomat's been doing really well. He's been working where now? Malaga? Well, he loves me now. So let's work on somebody else. Let's work on... Where does this mayor live? Okay, start working on the mayors and courtiers and stuff. Make them like us. 45%. Occupation of Fez. So my sieging Fez is actually helping my liege, even though I'm sieging it not for him, but for me. So as soon as we end this war, the occupation of Fez bonuses that he has will go away. Which is kind of funny. Kind of funny. Just wait. Tick, tick, tock. We're going to have to do the little scare tactic again, I think. Um, is Malis is, 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 is giving money to the charity? Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> no! <laughs> I love that event. We're actually charitable, so it's perfectly good. Plus, we gain a bunch of piety, which is good. Yeah, we're at 79%. Uh, they're at 72%. So we'll just wait until the actual siege fully finishes and then move the entire army. See if it scares them off. And he'll be gone on the third. And then we'll stay. Kind of gamey, but hey, that's the whole point of the series. That's what you came for, right? Messing with the AI, gaming the decadent system, and conquering the world as fast as possible. 
We started in 867, so it's already been almost 20 years. So we're kind of off to a slow start, but that's kind of the point with a... Uh, Oh, 100% perfect. So that's kind of the point, though, when you have, um... When you start off as a single kind of sheik, it just slows things down. If you start off as a sultan, you just start snowballing right away. We'll do a quick Ramadan, and then we'll consider declaring war on somebody else. And we've slept with some women, despite being incapable. Draw closer, give to charity. My liege is still losing, thankfully. Hopefully I can... Ooh, I became temperate and lost decadence. This will, this will be the death of me, though. But we'll lower decadence with our final act. Now we're incapable and ill. Minus five health. We had a base of five. So, no, we had a base of six. Because I started off wounded, and I bumped it up by one. So we're dead. We're going to die very soon. Um, not going to give any money away, because my son's going to need it. There goes Ramadan. We've lowered decadence to 4%. My poor son, bless his soul, he's going to have to start taking over soon. Um, let's just make sure he's proper, though. He's uh, I'm Andalusian Sunni. He's Andalusian Sunni. That's fine. He's 10. Who is educating you? Military man. Not bad. Okay. What can we do with our dying breath? Can't do a faction. We could just declare war directly on him. Claim Andalusia. We'll be hostile with them. I don't think it makes sense to declare war. And we're surviving! Never mind, we're not gonna die. We need to continue to attack small neighbors. It's just not time yet. Truce there. No truce here. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take over Granada. We can't raise our entire levy. Uh-oh. He's trying to weaken my army. I'm no longer craven. Good. That is a very good change. We'll actually go straight over to Almeria to pick up that last army that he is not allowing me to... He's trying to prevent me from, from combining them. July 25th. Okay, so he'll just leave. And now we're good. Got our whole army together. And now we'll just hang out in Granada. This is just a single county duke. Um, that was the, the duchy that my liege had given away. We'll take this land from him, and then... Um, Hopefully we'll be able to create that duchy so that, that that problem doesn't happen again. Not without somebody doing a faction or something. Okay, so the war ended, it looks like. Um, Emir of Cordoba, Sultan Abdallah. Alright, so somebody else is in power now. That's fine. That means that we can attack this guy, since he's no longer the liege. Perfect, we can take some more of Sevilla. And we're still, um... We can't do a faction because I'm incapable, but... We are... Yeah, we'll see. I'm actually playing during the day right now. My daughter came in the room. I muted the mic, though, because, you know, got to keep her innocent little voice secret. She wanted me to... We have these little cereal things that you can put cereal in, and then they, they're, like, compartmentalized, and you can turn it for them. So you can kind of dole out the cereal throughout the day. And uh, she always likes to get more and more cereal. The mission has so far been a success. Give to charity again. Charity is something you should pretty much do every single time you can. And somehow we inherited a mosque. So that's good. That actually increases our piety generation as well. By 0.2 per month. 
Okay, can we upgrade anything? Military training grounds? Um, yes, I think we'll do that. We're about to win this war. There's another army here. And what is this all about now? It's the Emir Abdul Rahman of Marwan Emirates. It's Prince Jabir's claim on Andalusia. So we got another guy now. No wonder they fired it. He's a gray eminent, Saeed, kind, diligent character. So he's going to get a lot of people that like him. So we have another succession crisis, basically. And we are fighting on the side of our liege. But this one's smaller than before. Hopefully... Hopefully, yet again, we don't end up having to lose our army or anything. Not that that happened last time, it's just... I really don't want to lose any land. Truces are expiring with uh, you. You live down here, so we can attack Septa. Septa? Septa. We have Grey Eminence Daughter. So our, our daughters are coming of age. Let's use them for some alliances. So the way that I like to do alliances is, like, take this guy, for example. You take him, he's very powerful, you marry, not to him, but to his son. He, he doesn't even have any wives, but even if he did, he'll usually have a wife slot open. So we'll give him one of our daughters. By having the current emir's son as a son-in-law, we'll be allies. Not just now, but also when he dies and his son takes over, then we'll still be allies. So you get two generations of alliance by doing it that way. Next, let's take the next most powerful guy in the realm. Which is surprisingly some random shake. This guy. How on earth do you have that much power? Um... That can't be right. I don't know how he got... Did he hire mercenaries or something? Here. We'll go with that guy. That guy's actually probably a better bet. You can have my other daughter. I think it was that one. I'm gonna give us a couple of alliances. My loving wife has decided that she would do a better job serving as your region. After all, who could, who but her could rule the realm in accordance with your own desires? I have a wife? <laughs> That's funny. That is really funny. I'm incapable, so the, the event text says, I have a wife? What do you... <laughs> I love it. Very, very funny. One marriage and the second marriage. So now we have two allies. And that is good. We're in bed with the other people. Notice as decadence goes down, our morale goes up tremendously, basically offsetting the difficulty setting and also increasing our domain income at a, map, at a cap of 20%. And I believe the morale goes up to 50%, which is huge. I used to think it was... I used to think that it was just... Um, oh, that's right, we captured your wife. You can rot for now. Can we do anything else to her? No. Fairly significant army coming from our ally. That's our ally's army, but he is not attacking us directly, he's attacking our liege. So stay out of my land, please. I prefer for you to not siege my stuff, buddy. Uh, he's become, she's become spy master. Interesting. So if we want to kill him, it'd be pretty easy, I guess, if we could get our daughter to help us out. Our daughters like us. They like us quite well. A little bit more siege stuff, and we will have this land. And we, we can probably start declaring double war soon, also. We have we have enough piety that we could declare two, and we have enough troops that I think we, we could handle two. The city should fall pretty quick. We could even assault, but I don't want to waste the troops. Who is it that's helping me? J Jata Bid Emirate is, for some reason, contributing 1,700 troops. For their own reasons. Both of my daughters now have become spy masters. <laughs> Those are some pretty ambitious young women. Alright. Ah, okay, so now we've inherited that war. And we can create the Duchy of Granada. So now we're a double duke, which is good. That'll increase our domain limit. They ended up getting the defensive bonuses, but we had a significantly stronger army. 
and we'll just put this guy down. This guy is actually him, and he is attacking now me in the conquest of Granada, so we just have to defend. Okay. Time for a break. I will take a break here. Um, actually, yeah, okay. We'll just siege all of his stuff at once. Spread them out real quick. Shoot. About a thousand. And about a thousand. Okay. Alright, I'll take a break here. I'll see you again in a little bit. Thanks for watching. See you soon.